Hi, my name is CJ Stryker. I'm 31 years old from New York, New York. I'm a social blogger and commentator for New York and Long Island. And six years ago, in 2007, I was diagnosed with HIV. But before I give you guys any advice, I have to give you a little history on me. I had an HIV scare in 2002. When I found out there was a possibility I might have the virus, I was crying every night. I couldn't eat. I couldn't sleep. I was having nightmares. I honestly thought that my life was going to be short, and I thought I was going to die. When I found out, luckily at the time, that I was negative, I promised myself I would educate myself. I researched it. I found out very important facts, like first, HIV and AIDS, two totally different things. And two, just because you have either or, it is not a death sentence. You have amazing treatments, you have amazing doctors, and you have so much support to cope with the situation. In 2007, I was diagnosed with HIV. And when that happened, because I was educated and I was prepared, I wasn't as affected by it. I was upset, I was disappointed with myself, but I was strong and I learned that it wasn't a death sentence. In New York City, you have the best doctors, and I'm on an amazing treatment right now. And because of it, I'm undetectable. My T cells are in the high 700s, and I'm living my life as if the virus doesn't exist. I live healthy, I eat healthy, I make sure that I make healthy choices, and most importantly, I enjoy life. Do not stress. Do not fret, do not fear. Just because you're paused doesn't mean it's over. Not by a long shot. First thing you need to do, once you find out, is see a doctor. A doctor will discuss with you the best treatments, and I promise, as long as you can take care of it quickly, you will live a very long life. It'll be like if the virus doesn't even exist. I encourage everybody, talk to someone, to talk to a peer educator, and express your concerns and your fears, because I promise they're gonna put him to rest. You guys got this. Anybody out there who's recently been diagnosed, have no fear, guys. Just, you know what, do not be afraid to tell your friends, do not be afraid to tell your parents, do not be afraid to tell anybody, because let me tell you, anyone with an amazing heart and anyone with an amazing human spirit, I swear, is going to be there for you. They're gonna hug you, they're gonna kiss you, they're gonna love you more than ever. Recently, I went on Facebook and I told all of my supporters that I am diagnosed. And let me tell you, you would be surprised how many people will come out and support and have your back. Once again, my name is Peter Stryker and you guys got